Hello fellow humans and bots, today is the day 18 of my world challenge, world meaning what I learned today. The challenge is all about me posting a video on everyday basis, talking about the key takeaways for the day, or if I had any BMNF moments. What is a BMNF you may ask? It means what blew my mind. So subscribe to my channel on YouTube in order to keep up with me and my challenge. And if you're watching this on Instagram, make sure you give me a follow. That would mean a world to me the world what do you mean a world the world to me today i wanted to talk about taking a pause no i'm not talking about taking a break i'm talking about taking a pause literally to not do anything what does that mean why is that necessary when is it necessary now correct me if i'm wrong there's this analogy in taoism that we need to go with the flow and become this water and be still so that the dust or the muddy water um, settles down in order to reveal clarity don't quote on me I'm not sure if that's Taoism, but I read it somewhere. It's not necessarily a, a, a clarity towards what you want to do, but in most cases, when you take a pause, you realize the things that you need to run away from. You realize the things that's not good for you and move away from them now remember how Katy perry used to talk uh sing about the plastic bag in the air in the firework uh song um do you really think does it do the wind gonna start again i don't know the lyrics but it has something to do with plastic bag drifting through the wind so likewise in our life we get drifted through certain influences right society influences sets an expectation on us if your gender is female you have certain expectation if you are a male there's certain expectation and you sometimes unconsciously conform to those expectations i'll give you a very good example if you go to a doctor or a lawyer the first thing that they recognize themselves as an identity is that they're a lawyer they're a doctor before they see themselves as a son a father or husband or brother you get the point so mostly at least twice a week i sit with myself i take a pause it's sort of like meditating but also uh, you're actively thinking and listening to yourself i ask questions like who are you if i take away your race your religion your gender your age so what are you left with by asking this question what happens is you're left with the characteristics that will not change if your gender was different if your religion was different if your race was different it will still be a part of you and to me answering to that question i three key things i always remind myself is that i'm creative i'm committed and i'm curious now you can come up with certain values that resonates with you and keep that in mind in order to remind yourself that is what you truly are other than the identity that the society wants you to see what is the benefit of all these things you may ask well because life it's crazy life is chaos it's not order anything can happen at any moment there is a threat to all the identities that's given to you that's a, there's a threat to your race there's a threat to your religion there's a threat to your career you could lose a job you could immigrate to a new country and be among other people you you have to work with other people your boss might be a different race you could get divorced you're not that father husband avatar anymore you're someone else you're lost and you're thinking oh my god who am i if i'm not a husband or a father so you need to um, disassociate with yourself from all those external identity and have something in inside so deep and core that no one can take it away from you and that is why some people take a pause for a longer period of time because they've been in autopilot mode for a long time in order to come out of it 
they need a bigger pause and I feel like it's proportional to um, autopilot mode the more autopilot mode you're running your life the more bigger pause that you need for me I'm grateful that I'm more aware right now of who I am what defines me other than these external layers that I carry around uh, and I remind myself periodically so these pauses are like an hour half hour in a week every week is enough for me to remind myself and ground myself it's still a challenge so how do you figure out what you really want to do in life aren't you supposed to take a pause and think about it well like i said from my personal experience taking a pause will only make you understand what you are good at and what are the things that you need to let go and resist you know again going back to Taoism you need to go with the flow you need to understand what you are innately born with and nurture that so you have to try different things that will nurture your core value and see which one is getting attracted to you rather than you chasing something something that is natural to you so the only way to figure out what you really want to do with your life is to try various things well that is all for today go ahead take a pause try it ask yourself these questions that i recommended tell me if it ever helps you let me know in the comments below. Give this video a thumbs up if you're watching on the YouTube or a double tap if you're watching on Instagram. That will mean a lot to my mental health. With that, I will see you guys again tomorrow. Peace.